Welcome, my name is Marla and I'm an Aquarist here at the California Science Center. As an Aquarist, I help take care of some of our aquarium animals. One of the animals in particular is our East Pacific Red Octopus. Look how she uses her siphons to push water out of and propel over to greet us. How cool! In this next clip, you'll be able to see and hear what that looks like. So first thing in the morning, I clean out her habitat. She gets pretty curious about what I'm doing and uses her suckers to investigate. Like any octopus, she has eight arms and hundreds of suckers which she uses for tasting. You'll see that here in just a second. Would you like to hear how strong her suction is? Okay, listen to this. Red octopuses have great eyesight. Doesn't it look like she's eyeing her neighboring exhibit? That's where our spot prawns live. Crustaceans are her favorite food, so she is given a variety of shrimp, crabs, and lobster a few times a week. Enrichment is incredibly important when working with octopuses as they are really smart. In this video, you can see the ball outside of her exhibit. Sometimes we will use toys or puzzle boxes to put the food inside of. The item inside of the water is something that I actually use for cleaning. She initially tried to get the food out of the opposite end, but realized that tactic was all wrong. She's poking her arm back inside of the tube, looking for any more food, making sure she didn't miss anything. And when she realizes that there's nothing left, she'll abandon the item and retreat into the rocks so that way she can eat peacefully. Other days, enrichment sometimes looks like her helping me out, pointing out all the spots I missed on the acrylic. She's a total ham for pictures, so we both want to make sure everyone can see her clearly, even though her camouflage makes her difficult to spot most days. Speaking of camouflage, octopuses have organs in their skin called chromatophores. That's what they use to change color to blend in and they have papillae, which are skin protrusions that they use to change texture to look like a rock with algae. Personally, this is one of my favorite things that she does. I had just given her food. It looks like it's probably blue crab because it's pretty large. She scoots across the sand and she's taking her food back to her den where she can eat in peace. And she just looks really funny. It's almost like she's walking across the sand with valuable luggage. Now it's the close of another day and it appears to be that time for our little friend to retire. I wanna thank every one of you so much for joining us today. I hope you all had a great time and we can't wait to see you in the future.